unfortunately, Eric Levy passed away. He grew in very old age, and he was always active in, in the Assange community. Here's a photograph of him uh, being, you know, dragged away by the British police because he came to protest against the injustice that's being committed against Assange. And he died at 94. And he's very kind. I met him once in London, just very briefly, you know, he's, he's very kind. And um, he's always been an activist like that. I always heard this uh, sort of legend about him. It's true, though, you can, you can look it up and find articles about it, that he went to Iraq before it was bombed uh, to act as a human shield. So uh, he, along with a bunch of other people uh, from the UK, from various countries, they, they went to, to Iraq and they just huddled up in important buildings to act as human shields to stop the invasion in 2003, to stop the British, the Americans from bombing um, uh, those locations. So very brave. I don't know many people who would do that. That takes a lot of bravery. Here's a video. This is when I was in London doing the, um, the Assange thing in, in, in 2020. I filmed and photographed this, what was happening. They said police harassing an old man wearing a kufia as they attempt to shut down a vigil for Assange. So that old man is Eric. You know, it's Eric. And you can see here he's holding bent judges are killing Assange. <laughs> In the UK, bent means corrupt. So, you know, the police, they're trying to get him to leave. And he, he's just like, <laughs> he acts like he doesn't understand and just looks away. It's so funny. Police are being turned upon the people. We need freedom of here. speech. We need unity. We need That's community it. to survive. It's going to be difficult times ahead, folks. We're going to need people to pull together because the police are being used against the people they're supposed to be protecting. That's you and me. Tell Poor guy. So he, I, I just want to say that he passed away. He, he's really loved among this, you know, entire Assange community. And he's, he's a really good soul. And uh, rest in peace.